Hey, hello everyone. I've been gone for a while, but I'm back. And uh, here's a quick little moto tip. It's uh, about using some of these fall-offs. Right? I've got this segmented little worm-like carapace going on here. We've got a pretty decent polygon flow. Good lines going up and down. But I'm wanting to get some of this a little bit more dynamic. Right, the way these ridges come up. I'm going to put one right down the center and I'm going to show you how to use just a fall off uh, to make it really easy. Uh, first things, let me see. Select that loop. Mm, I don't need this. I don't need any of that. And probably up to there can't see it too much but there's just a center line right down the middle right there uh, so with that selected I've got a pretty good idea I'll, you know I'll turn off the uh, advanced might help a little bit there now you can see some pretty good stuff all right right down the center I'm just going to uh, I don't want to I don't want to affect any of these here because this is already pinched things are already getting too close but all of oh okay got everything okay so uh, here in the fall off so I'll take this radial and I just drag it out right it's one dimensional right now I can turn it over this way hit the center and pull it out uh, the typology is really good so I'm not going to be affecting anything on either side of this so I can just Put it about right there. Uh, only this is selected, so only that's going to be really affected, so it'll be okay. Uh, let's see. Eh, maybe center it a little bit. We can adjust it as we're doing it. You'll see what happens in a minute. I wish there was a way to rotate this. If there is, somebody to chime in and let me know. That would be great to be able to get a rotation on that. Well, but anyway, uh, let's see. So I've got this set up. Got a radial set up right hit the W key right and pretty nice simple the typology is kinda helping things out a little bit you know it's pretty good typo typology so it makes that part pretty easy right undo it pull it back up now you can play with it w moving the fall off right how much fall off do you want now if I had more selected it would affect every it would affect more see it's not affecting anything but if I had the uh, next polygon line or the next uh, lines right here selected I could have a fall off on them also but I want to keep those low so I'm only affecting those center line but that's just the move tool and here's the actual deformer animate that kind of cool anyway get a good idea what I'm what's going on right I want to make the test ah, hard to say what, what I'm going to want to do with that I don't want it to be too big I don't want it to be too small hmm we'll try that anyway you get the idea it's just the radial deform uh, radial fall off right and put it where you want it. Alright, later.